Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope that everyone is doing great. In this video, I will be recommending some great horror manhua that you can read if you are searching for new manhua to read. So without any delay, let's get on the list. First up on the list, LAG with 113 plus chapters. I'll rate LAG 910. The art style is top-notch, stacked with non-stop gore and merciless fight scenes. There's not much plot armor for the characters and you can't even predict who will die next. On number 9, Pigpen with 40 chapters. Pigpen is a 1010 psychological horror webtoon. The depth of its storyline is so amazing and full of surprises. Its art style is also marvelous, pushing out the essence of the characters with each stroke. And on number 8, Leviathan with 214 chapters. Leviathan is one of the best survival horror webcomics I've ever read. Its top-tier post-apocalyptic plot is packed with masterful action and suspense scenes. The art panels are phenomenal, and you can even feel the existential dread lurking in the depths of the oceans. On number 7, Bastard with 46 chapters. From the author of Shotgun Boy, Pigpen, and Sweet Home Comes Bastard, a masterful psychological horror manhua stacked with a string-tight plot and top-tier art. The gripping game of cat and mouse between the mad father and his scarred son is so damn good. I could feel tension lurking in the corners of each chapter. Don't miss this 10-10 must-read masterpiece. On number 6, Shotgun Boy with 68 chapters. Shotgun Boy is a solid 9-10 and one of the best horror webtoons I've read. The art style makes you feel the dark, edgy, and string-tied terror with each passing chapter. This goodies character development and plot are also among the best I've read. Number 5. Parallel City with 148 chapters. I'll rate Parallel City a solid 9-10. This horror manhwa has hooked me so much that I spent a night reading all of its available chapters. Its plot is just so gripping and full of twists. The art style? I wasn't expecting much, but damn, it's good. The cast of characters is also well developed, with each individual having depth and selfish goals. Number 4. Surviving Romance with 102 chapters. Surviving Romance is a 10-10 hidden gem. The art style looks sleek and well-crafted. The plot might start simple but shifts quickly into a web-like psychological thriller. Number 3. Hive with 242 chapters. This manhwa deserves a solid 8-10. Despite its simple plot and so-so art style, this survival horror webcomics, storytelling and pacing are top-notch. You'll keep flipping for the next chapter before you know it. And on number 2. Distant Sky with 36 chapters. This manhwa is a must-read 9-10 hidden gem. This horror webcomic is among the few tales that made me feel so unnerved and uneasy. The art style looks clumsy at first, but as you read more, you'll realize it pushes on your nerves. Last but not least, Sweet Home with 141 chapters. This manhwa doesn't need any ratings. The art style is just gold for a horror manhwa. Murky, brooding, and creepy. The eldritch-like abominations within the story are also well-crafted. And it's also been released as web series in Netflix. 